Oh, hi there partners. As you can see, I'm out here with my gear on. Gear is extra important with the M1A. You gotta make sure you're well camouflaged. And in this video, I'm gonna be firing some facts for you guys about the M1A. Oh yeah. So let's get into this review, shall we? Okay, so the M1A is a beast of a sniper rifle. As you saw with my introduction, gone, what a sexy sniper, am I right? This is one of the best snipers in the division. If not the best sniper to get your hands on, it absolutely penetrates. It is recommended to use the tech signature when sniping or something that increases your damage, like the possibility, so you can down enemies faster and hit them harder. There are different versions of this sniper that you can get. I recommend keeping an eye out for the first wave or SOCOM. The classic M1A doesn't have a grip on it for a mod, so you will be without an attachment if you find the classic one. But nonetheless, it can still wreck. You'll just be without one attachment. Recommended sounds to get on any sniper is brutal. Balance is another good one to gain immediate control of your snipe and have more of an accurate shot or stable. Deadly is also good for extra damage and vicious too, or even the one town that gives you 57% extra damage for your last bullet, so the final round in the sniper does some extreme damage. Just waste all of your bullets till you get to the final round, then surprise your opponent with some heavy damage. That's what I like doing anyways. Of course, getting lucky enough to have three of these amazing talents on your sniper makes you pretty daggone special. In my opinion, just finding one of these on your snipe is amazing. Two, heck yeah, and three, what the heck, how many did you have to craft or find to get that many good talents? You're one lucky son of a gun. Anyways, the M1A shoots pretty fast, so that's pretty good for it being a sniper rifle. And also, this goes for any other sniper use. Make sure you are trying to use explosive rounds before you snipe someone in the dark zone especially, because it can land some very powerful damage. Enough damage to maybe take down your opponent in one or two hits. So if you have the moment of surprise, on them with some explosive rounds if they're still living that is they might want to heal as fast as they can and speaking of heavy damage you also want to make sure that your gear is re-rolled around your marksman rifle to hit harder so yes increase your marksman rifle damage on your gear if you have that option or increase your critical hit chances gear is extremely important as you saw in the very beginning of this video my godly gear that i was using was definitely a huge bonus to my marksman rifle it makes me hit my enemies a lot harder and not to mention they don't see me coming of course as for how you actually get your hands on this i suggest to keep up to date with what the vendors are selling at the boo and at the dark zone it used to be sold at dz03 there was actually a 204 high-end blueprint sadly i wasn't high enough level though at the time in the dark zone to get it though and dz03 also used to sell a superior in one a2, but it didn't really have that great of talents on it. Unfortunately though, the vendor there is not selling it no more. So once again, just be sure to stay up to date with what the vendors are selling if you want to try and purchase this, especially if you want to try to get the blueprint. Also, it can of course be dropped as a random drop as well. You're just going to have to get lucky enough to find it, and also for it to have some good talents on it. But yeah, there you guys have it. A quick review of what the M1A is capable of and how to get your hands on it. As always, at the end of my videos, I like to be a like whore and remind you guys to show some support by leaving a like. Or maybe sharing this video to someone else to show them how much of a weirdo I am. It'd be nice to see this video surpass 700 likes, but that'll probably not happen. But it'd definitely be nice to see, I'll tell you that much. In the end, after me saying this, I'll probably just be told to F off and quit asking for likes at the end of my videos. Quit being a dirty slut, Rifle. I'm unsubscribing now. And that I sound like a like whore and I just need to shut my whore mouth. Don't worry, I completely understand if you think that and you actually say that. But this has been your rifle. Remember to stay safe out there, everyone from rapists. The world seems to be filled with those for some odd reason. And try to avoid sleeping in poop. Peace out.